Hello, this is Andy from Walt Motor Company in Newbury and welcome to the sale of this 2013-13 registered Renault Megane convertible. This car is the 1.4 TCE Floride Special Edition. So I did a bit of research on these. They, there was a global run of 1,200 cars as I read it and 168 of those cars were registered in the UK. They're all numbered um, and got a little plaque inside to tell you which number it is. As you can see, finished in what I would call probably, if you're as old as me, ermine white. It's like old English white with two-tone black and cream leather interior, quite flamboyant on the inside. I think the outside colour probably um, is to promote the inside colour. It all matches together quite well. You'll see that the wheels are colour-coded too, uh, exactly as it was uh, the day it was registered. So very wild car very sort of individual car a bit of personality about it this car's only covered 37,000 miles and has been serviced three times uh, in its service book drives without fault so without further ado let's have a look at the interior driver's door card in excellent condition as you can see no real wear marks or wear and tear on it as we swing round to the interior there we are with the red and, and uh, cream leather. Really, really nice condition. There's a couple of little wear marks on the leather, as you might ex expect at this age. Um, and again, just down there where your bum goes. But that's a pretty wild interior, isn't it? With the roof down, it really does stand apart. Really nice condition all the way through. A couple of little bits to show you, but really nothing significant. Um, good level of spec as well, so let's have a look at that. So the two-tone leather steering wheel in good order all the way around. No particular depreciation uh, deterioration there. There's a couple of little marks just there on the steering boss. The current mileage over there on the right is 36,961. You'll see in the middle you get an LCD display for engine temperature, fuel and uh, road speed and obviously revs on the left. You have your cruise control uh, controls on the steering wheel with this. The car has auto wipers, telephone connectivity and auto lights which are on this side. It also has the colour sat nav which is TomTom Tom based on board. You'll notice that there is a little mark there up on the um, sort of top of the dashboard. The car has the his and hers climate control, radio CD and push button go you don't need to have these keys in there it's just a place to store them in fact i'll leave those out for a second because if i just scoot underneath you'll see that this car is number 1030 of the global 1200 i mentioned earlier electric roof switch a little pot for something there there's a six-speed manual gearbox and these are your um, controls for the radio and the sat nav two keys for the car passenger seat excellent condition you know a couple of little marks here or there I don't want to do it down because it's um it's just such an unusual car Floride is mentioned on the dashboard that side and you'll see the rest of the dashboard and the plastics all in good condition rear seats really for occasional use I suppose there's two seats in the back making this a four seat in total but in good order there's a little mark on the leather down there other than that very very clean and tidy as are the sides um, which are I think leather covered all good uh, obviously with the roof down that's going to restrict the boot space but you still get a fair bit in there to be fair you can certainly get a couple of suitcases the roof itself is panoramic I'll give you a better view of that in a minute when I put the roof up but again, all clean and tidy under here and in good condition. My apologies, you need to see my face at this point in the proceedings, but I thought I'd just do um, the clip of the roof going up. So behind me, you'll see the, um, the cover come up and then the panoramic roof will come over the top of me just to show you how the operation works. All electric little boot bit goes down like so 
and the windows will go up, I guess. Well, actually, I'll push the button again, and the windows will go up just like that, giving you this wonderful panoramic roof. So, two cars in one. So, apologies for frightening you with my face if you were watching with the kids, but just to give you another view of the panoramic roof there so plenty of light comes in it does have a little blind if you want to pull it across but why would you certainly in the summer it's nice and pan roof and convertible perfect we'll just take a step back from the car so you can see what it looks like with the roof up it's actually super design they've um they've clearly spent some time working this out i know it's based on a sort of normal mcgann but it's very sleek, very stylish, I think. So it reminds me a little bit of sort of cars from the 50s and 60s with the colour scheme, but luckily I wasn't born then, um, but not too long after. Really pretty car. So there we go. There's a couple of little marks on the wheels, nothing too significant, one or two little chips around the car. But I just wanted to focus more on the fact that it's such a nice place to be. You know, that interior and the pan roof really make it, you know, as good as a Mercedes or a BMW or, you know, one of the fancy expensive cars. There's a lot of spec in there and there's a lot of sort of flash for your cash, if you know what I mean. I think, um, I think it's different and certainly at the moment it's the only one for sale in the country. If you'd like to come and see the car, it's in Newbury and Berkshire, so do give me a ring. My name's Andy on 07786 742 422 and thank you for watching the video.